Lady. What in the heck? Did you get out of the garbage that's bright yellow? Oh. I took the garbage can off of the toilet because I get so sick of looking at the ugly garbage can on the top of the toilet instead of being on the ground. But since Lady has zero control and loves to eat trash. She doesn't chew on anything in the house. Uh, she she never, never. You guys, she has paper. never chewed anything. Not a shoe, not a piece of clothes, not a blanket, not a wall, not a chair, not a pillow. Nothing! The only thing she eats is stuff out of the garbage if the garbage can is not on the toilet seat. She's gross. <laughs> Well, we just got back from filming episode seven of the new custom house building pr project. Oh my gosh. I want, my brain wanted to say program, but it was, what? Project. <laughs> if you missed it, I'll link the video in the description for you. Have we sat here at this piano before and you cried? Yeah. Have we sat at this piano and I've yelled? Yeah. Okay, so now that that's out of the way, <laughs> we have the cutest little song. I was helping Boston practice, and it was a good practice, and I had the thought to be really impatient and like, yo, but I didn't, and it turned out to be so sweet. So, Bossy, take it away. <laughs> um, He was practicing that song and was having a hard time. And I said, well, instead of counting, I said, count in your head and I'll sing to it. And it put the sweetest smile on his face and he was like, I love you, mom. It was the cutest, sweetest thing. So of course we're gonna show you the good, but I had to remind you that it's not always cute. In other news, I've never eaten a fennel. I've never cut up a fennel, so guys, the first for everything, am I right? That's the wrong note, that's the wrong note, boss, that one. What? That one, that very last one. This one? Yes, is it a line or a space? It's a line, and this one is a space. Update on the fennel. I was really like, I don't wanna cut this, it's probably not gonna be good. It smells almost like black licorice. Oh! I it's gonna be good. You wanna hear me do the Patrick voice that I know? <laughs> Quarantine for Olivia is over. I cleaned their bathroom because this is um, the only bathroom that we let Olivia use while she was in quarantine. And I use the term quarantine very loosely. <laughs> but she did have the bathroom to herself so that she wasn't, you know, sharing. So much. The mailman is here again for like the fourth time today. <laughs> is it the mailman? Yeah, he keeps coming back to packages. <laughs> I bet they love us. Okay. Okay, hold on. Hold on, Joel. Come tap on this. My nose is come tap on it and my nose isn't working. Okay, stay here because it might go out of focus. <laughs> Get over here. Right here. <laughs> now we gotta wait for the freezer to stop filling up with water. Oh. <laughs> Just wait, hey, I'm the one that's gonna be late for my nail appointment. I thought you run late. <laughs> it's because I'm on Boston. <laughs> and I'm doing so much work at all. I can't even say that with a straight face. I know. All right, let's get this stupid Okay, 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 okay. Nail day already. <laughs> Such an idiot, I don't know what to say. <laughs> <laughs> so the time has come. Oh Two weeks already, huh? Too cute to be forgotten. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, hold on. <laughs> now everything I say is gonna sound like Santa. <laughs> I'm late. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh jeez. Okay, I just got that. It's been two weeks. <laughs> All right, it's been two weeks. I am ready to get these nails changed, even though they're probably some of my faves. Can you guys see, I have cut up an entire pineapple, in winter. and I have nothing left. 
<laughs> the kids ate it faster than I could cut it up. Pineapple right. doesn't go very far with four children. No, it doesn't. Especially adults. this one because it is so good. On a piece. This one. Don't mind me. Easy to fit. Dad, can you put this in the bag? Mm-hmm. Huh? Yowza, that is really good. Isn't that delicious? What do you want me to do? Put that in the bag? Yeah. Let's go plant it in the garden, see if we can grow one. I think the trick is, is to get a Thank pineapple you. on Christmas and then wait so many weeks. Christmas? That is not from Christmas. On Christmas. No, we cut that one up. Uh-uh. And ate Olivia. it. No, because Aunt Julie I... brought, came one and brought one to us. Yeah, we yeah, ate that. We ate that. With Aunt like, Julie. Right? <laughs> it's in a vlog. I can prove it. Oh, this man. was a 99 cent pineapple. What? Yep, it was 99 cents. That's why I've been buying them, because they're cheap. You want to buy what's cheap? cheap. And and Lee's, I think. Have Lee's? Lee's yes. is the best. Did you already take Look my balloon this. apart? I have been cutting and cutting and there is no <laughs> Boss Lincoln, did Boston get some? Nope. Boston! Bossy, come here! Boston! Mm. So I think he's going potty. We are going to get ready for a road trip. Yeah! I want all of you to go get me a pair of, <laughs> a pair of pajamas. <laughs> Bring me a pair of pajamas. Oh. Bring me a swimsuit underwear for four days underwear for four days okay go for dinner we're doing another fridge dump salad style um i had leftover salad so we're using it i had asparagus so we're using it we're gonna take these hard-boiled eggs with us on the road tomorrow i think we'll do like toast for breakfast and it'll stay good till we're home um but that's it that is it. <laughs> um, I have a very empty fridge and that's fantastic because I really don't like the food going to waste. Stand over your pile and if you, tell me if you have this. Do you have your church pants? Yes. yes. Do you have your church belt? Yes. Church black shoes? Yes. yes. Two of them? Yes. yes. Church black socks? Yes. A shirt? And then I'm going to bring your bow ties. Yeah. Do no one touch the piles. Come on out. Yeah. Kids, go downstairs and pick up your bedroom. Pick up your bedroom. Do it again because I'm sure there's more. Our plans were to get up and road trip down to St. George to visit Aunt Ellie. We were going to spend the weekend there and it's Jackson's baptism. And so we really were excited to spend some time with them because we miss them. We miss them. We haven't seen their new house and they have a baptism this weekend. We miss them. We have crappy news. So everyone tested negative for COVID. We even wanted- Olivia. Even Olivia did. Um, last night before right before we went to bed we wanted to test right before we left Lincoln tested positive for COVID and at first I was like well maybe Joel and Lincoln can stay home and the rest of us can go and then or maybe we'll like wait until tomorrow or, or Friday because today's Wednesday and we'll go like Friday so we're toying with the idea of like all these different scenarios and then I just thought, okay, if if let's say Julie, one of her kids was tested positive and then the rest of them showed up, I would feel uncomfortable and I'm thinking about my mom trying to recover from her mouth surgery that was pretty extensive. Um, I just couldn't imagine my mom catching it or I couldn't imagine little baby Tommy or Amelia or nursing Julie nursing catching it. I just, I would want whoever had it to stay home. And so it was a really tough decision and we all bawled. Like we all cried this morning. Um, we need to go through, <laughs> bless you. My goodness. We need to go through and put all of our, stuff that we packed away even though Lincoln tested negative or positive on one we were like let's go get another brand so we even got a different brand of test and it was positive and we even tested Olivia with two separate brands and it was and she was negative on both and so last night Joel was up with Lincoln because I didn't hear Joel I feel so guilty that I was didn't hear you get up with Lincoln but 
Anyway. He's hey! Bless you. He's really coffee and so we're bummed. I'm bummed for Lincoln, but you know him. Nothing keeps him down. He's like eating ice cream, having the time of his life. <laughs> Even if he doesn't feel good, he's having the time of his life. All right, everyone come tell me what you want from the grocery store. We're gonna make a list and probably do like, what's it called when they like the pickup where you go pick up so you don't have to go into the store. Oh, I see those drinks, the, the icy drinks. Ice drinks. Let me show you our fridge. Guys, I meant business when I was telling you that. Yeah, that we were cleaning out our fridge. Oh, snacks like the road trip. Yeah, we have hard boiled eggs. And potatoes and onion. We've got two variations of onion in here. That's what we've got. So let's uh, let's uh, put together a list of whatever we want and pizzas. make an order. Potatoes pizza. Party pizzas. Uh, icy drinks. <laughs> that ice okay, what about food? Um, uh, um, um, lunchables. Oh. Wait, no, no, no. 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 <laughs> Oranges, uh, ch chippies. What kind? Barbecue and Dirt. ice cream. Actually, no, not ice cream. Not ice cream. Uh, um, we need to get those, those popsicles. Ice the vinegar, cream. the vinegar one. No, 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 no. The popsicles, the coconut popsicles. Oh. Do they sell those still? Even though you guys are not the ones that are sick, I'm still letting you get whatever you want because yeah. we're missing out on a really awesome weekend. Okay, Cody, come here. Didn't you want raspberry frosted donuts? <gasps> yes. Yay! You guys are going crazy. Oh, pineapple. <gasps> Another pineapple. Can we get like two? Watermelon! Because I know we're gonna, we've plowed through one I'm gonna yesterday. get pineapple, apples, get grapes. grapes. Wait, no. Berries. Watermelon. There is no watermelon story right now. Pineapple. I wrote that down. Lincoln, come here. Link! I'm going to get everything to make a curry soup. All right, COVID boy. That's what Grandpa Griffith called <laughs> He's all, hey, Kobe. <laughs> Are you sad that you got COVID? With Olivia, when she had it, I had her wearing a mask and it didn't seem to bother her, which I was okay with. And he, I was like, all right, Link, let's put a mask on him. And the second he put it on, I was like, nope. I was like, you are not wearing a mask. He has a harder time with his asthma and I don't know, you just, there's a difference. Mm, I don't know, it's just what we've decided. He's not gonna wear one. It's gonna be a little more difficult. I'm not, I didn't let Olivia touch anything. Um, it's a little harder with him because he doesn't really listen. <laughs> um, we're gonna try and be really careful. He said he sat next to a girl at school that said, my mom said that I had to come to school even though I have COVID and she didn't wear a mask. Mm-hmm. So. We're thinking that's where Lincoln got it from. That's what I think anyway. And uh, the day that Olivia got it, I think. And possibly from Olivia, yeah. People might make fun of me. Of course it was from Olivia. Well, that's just what I'm thinking and that's just the story I'm saying, so just. I'm a human and I can have my opinions too. You can have yours. We might not agree and that's okay. Is there anything specific you want from the grocery store? Um, more packs of the blood oranges. You want some more oranges? The okay. blood oranges. Okay, all right. Like two more packs of the blood oranges. <laughs> well, we literally ate an entire package last night. Yeah, I'll get you another package. <laughs> Anything else? Um, Your handsome little guy. Frosted Flakes. Frosted the, Flakes. I like them. <laughs> They're crunchy. All right, Frosted Flakes it is. The bag. Okay. Oh, a big bag. Yeah, because they're big and we almost ate the whole pack of life in a whole day. So we need a big pack. <laughs> Takes a cereal eating serious, folks. <gasps> I forgot to show you my nails. Well, here is the lovely after. I mean, quarantine has never seen such beautiful nails. Well, not near as adventurous. Or fun filming this as it was the before. That was hilarious. That was like the funniest day of my life. <laughs> my boyfriend just winked at me, so I think he concurs. All right, guys. 
I just want to say that I love you. I appreciate you. Thank you for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, I mean, there's a lot to unenjoy, but there's also like a part to enjoy that you're just like watching someone else. And okay, okay, I got to say this really quick. I was getting my nails done and I was telling my nail girl about this TikTok that I watch and she was like, oh yeah. She's like, I have been watching this girl. That is a trucker. She's like, she's like 20. She decided to be a trucker and she lives out of her truck and she um she's like i'm i'm obsessed i watch every single video and it's of her just living her best in this truck eating out of it sleeping out of it like whatever what have you and i just thought you know why do we love watching each other <laughs> Like as humans, I don't know. We also love to hate each other, which is really sad But for those of you that have watched our videos that are just here to see what's going on Thanks. I hope you guys have a really good weekend. We're going to take an extra long weekend Genuinely from the bottom of my heart. I love you. Bye guys Filming from filming Wait, what the heck is on the rug? Did she get into the garbage again? Comment down below. Do you think it's funny? Comment comment down below if you think it's funny or dumb. <laughs> I don't care. Okay, even <gasps> our new ones. Not your new ones. Not your new ones. I would say like we actually. Okay. Hello. Come a little closer in. <laughs> no, no, no. I like your eye in the corner like that though. Okay, I want uh, I one of those. No, no, wait. I'm going to get every. Hold on. Come here. Come here, Kobe. Come here. Lincoln!